Hi everyone. So today I'm going to show you this really cool feature of the uh, auto leveling CR touch. Now I have these two beds. You see, this one is really thin. This is the original Creality bed. And I have this awesome glass bed, but this one is really thick. Like the thickness of these two beds are definitely don't match. And sometimes this bed is bendable and this is, this is not. So it depends on what I'm printing. I might need to use the glass bed or the original bed depend on, depending on what I'm printing. What if I tell you that you can switch these two bed regardless of the bed thickness, you don't need to re-level the printing bed. How awesome would that be, right? Well, that's what the CR Touch would do for you and allow you to just change the bed without actually needing to re-level the printer here. So let's take a look. So if I'm gonna stop this print and then I'll take this bed off, And all I'm going to do is take this one out and we'll put this bed in here. And now I can go ahead and start printing. And while it's warming up, I'm just going to put the clips. Without having to re-level the bed, this should automatically work. All I need to do is to auto-home the printer so it can measure the distance again. So now I'm just going to go here and you see um, I'm going to go to prepare and I'm going to auto-home the printer first. And then after I auto-home, then I can be able, I'll be able to, uh, let me stop the print first. Sorry, I started a print already. So let me stop the print and then I be able to um, go here and then control and oops, prepare auto home. Now I should be able to auto home. It'll measure the a new bed level automatically. And I don't need to re-level, even though the thickness between these two beds are just crazy different. But the CR Touch will be able to measure the new bed now, and it knows where zero is. It'll automatically uh, be able to print on the new bed. So now if I start printing then it'll automatically print on this bed and it should just work as as is we'll see how that works it'll take some time uh, for the printer to heat up again Yeah, this is the CR Touch. It's really cool. So, um, so far, the installation has been very straightforward. I made a full video on how to uh, install this and wire it and everything. Um, I'm going to make another video on how to do just the leveling because you do need to do the initial uh, leveling manually. After that, your life is so much easier. So, adding the CR Touch really beneficial so far has been for me and now i have these two beds i can switch between them without the hassle of having to re-level the printer that's really great uh the the software like it's just uh i flushed the new firmware and it picked it up right away uh really did not have any issues with it so far i'm loving this uh, let me know if you have any experience with the cr touch uh i did not really experience anything negative uh, so far this has been great 
aside of from like the initial installation and the initial setup, which requires some work. But after that, when it's all you know said and done, this has been working great for me so far. And you can see like now it's it's gonna remeasure the bed level and then it'll print based on the new bed distance without me having to mess with these uh you know knobs and springs and all that and by the way it comes with these rubbers pad that are much better than the weak springs that comes with the stock default printer um so yeah so far it's been really nice and check it out it looks like it's printing already um yeah this this bed the stickiness of this bed is not great for me this is the original bed i've had it for like five years um but check it out it's already printing no problem um the leveling is perfect and it's already picking it up and printing the first layer just fine um this is impressive uh, honestly and i'm loving this so far Yeah, let me know what you think. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. Or if you have had any issues with the installation or the setup, I'm happy to help. Uh, so far, like again, for me, it's been really easy. Um, let me know what your thoughts. And thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.